Hello and welcome. Let's talk about clubfoot or CTV, known as congenital telepes equinovarus deformity. So, what does it mean by clubfoot or CTV? It is a congenital deformity characterized by equinus and varus positioning of the foot, which becomes apparent at birth. This is much commoner in boys than in girls. The other name is telepes equinus varus deformity. Club foot means club-like appearance of the foot. Talipes is a Latin word where talis means ankle and pes means foot. It is a deformity that causes the patient to walk on ankle. Now, this is a normal foot, but in case of baby with club foot, this is how it is presented. Now, deformity is found in foot club. Small heel and short tendino acaris. Four foot shows adduction and supination. Hind foot shows equinus, which is plantar flexion, and varus, which is inward twisting. Now, this is cavus, this is adductus, this is varus, and this is equinus as shown in the picture. Now, what are the bony changes that occur in club foot? The calcaneum undergoes varus, and there is a smaller size of the calcaneum. The tibia undergoes internal tibial torsion, and the talus undergoes equinus with medial deviation, and the neck of the Talus is debited while head is subluxated. Navicular bone is medially displaced. Metatarsals are medially deviated, and all the bones of the foot are plantar flexed. Now, soft tissue involvement in club foot. All ligamentous structures on middle side of the foot, posterior aspect of the ankle are shortened. Tissue is histologically normal, while muscles of the calf are hypoplastic. The flexures of the toes and inverters of the foot and tendo Achilles are short. Now, what are the types of club foot? It may be idiopathic, which is congenital, or atherogryposis multiplex congenital, and neurological causes like meningocele, cerebral palsy, polymyelitis, and due to acquired broad bone toma. Now, causes of club foot. Idiopathic, where there is no any definitive cause. Medial displacement of the navicular and calcaneus around the ankle, increased intrauterine pressure during pregnancy, or in case of prim baby which has higher incidence due to genetic reasons, or due to primary soft tissue defect with secondary bone changes, and due to prenatal muscle imbalance theory. Now, pathoanatomy the talus is pointed downwards, the neck debited medially, body is slightly outward rotated, navicular and entire forefoot. Shifted medially and rotated into supination. Skin and soft tissue of calf and middle side of the foot are short and underdeveloped. And in uncorrected cases, secondary bone and soft tissue changes occur. Now, treatment. The conservative treatment includes at birth passive stretching done by the mother after each breastfeed and various correction followed by correction of equinus deformity. Plaster at thin, soft skin not done until 7 to 10 days after birth. After 7 to 10 days, serial plaster is done. The serial plaster can be tried till 6 month age at weekly interval for 6 weeks, then bi weekly for the next 6 weeks or more. After correction, corrective sew or splints for 1 to 2 years. Now, surgical treatment. The indications for surgical treatment in club foot include right rigid club foot, inadequate response to serial plaster, relapsed club foot, recurrent club foot associated with muscle imbalance, and resistant club foot, which is totally resistant. Now, operation. Up to 4 years of age, posterior medial release with elongation of tendo Achilles. After 4 years, posterior medial release with Dyer's lateral closed osteotomy, Evans calcaneo cuboid cancellation or fusion, and in case of older children or adolescents, telectomy, tendon transfer, triple atherosis, and treatment by axial fixators can be done. Now, this is a picture where the initial visit of the club foot which after treatment has undergone into this sort of correction. Now, the treatment of club foot is shown here from stage 1 to stage 5. End of the topic.